attic. Got no heat call. We're gonna see what happens. So we're calling for heat. This is a Bryant unit from 2001. It's on the uh, blower purge cycle because we killed the power and called for heat. So that's gonna show a status code 12. So we're gonna wait till this happens and check the sequence of operation and see what's going on. Okay, so we got our inducer. Pressure switch should be closing and then we should get our igniter. Alrighty, so nothing's happening, but we are getting an air code in there. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, one. So it's either a 31 or a 13. So let's see, 13 is limit or flame rollout switch trip. 31 is a pressure draft safeguard auxiliary limit switch or blocked vent switch. So pretty much a pressure switch is in closing, or it could be a rollout switch. So let's go ahead and check this out. Okay, so we had a rollout switch right here that was tripped, so I reset it. So let's try this again. We're not getting our, not getting a, uh, a dummy light anymore. So that's a good sign. Oh, there we got igniter. on the gas valve, just in case. Oh, that's interesting. All right, blower's engaged. It's not doing anything different, so I don't think we got a crack. So we're gonna go ahead and set up the manometer and see what the gas pressure is, because it should definitely not be doing that. So here we go. Okay, so. We got some crazy flame action going on. We're gonna go ahead and pull the test port, which is right here. This particular one uses the uh, the service wrench port, and then this is our adjustment screw. So we're gonna hook up our handy dandy manometer, this guy right here, and we'll see what's up. So, yep. All right, so we are cycling our heat. Igniter's heating up. It's gonna kind of back up a little bit. Alrighty, so we pulled off the flue pipe. So we're gonna see what happens now. Maybe we have a clogged flue pipe. So we got ignition, or we got our hot surface igniter, and here goes the gas. Uh, yeah, looks like it's running better. So we might have a clogged flue pipe. Not a complete clog because obviously the pressure switch was closing. All right, nobody bypassed that thing. Nope. So yeah, looks like we got a clog in our flue pipe, so we need to check that out. And there's definitely some stuff in there. So, onto the roof. All right, so we're on the roof. Uh, here's the flue cap. Check this out. We took this. So as you can see, the pipe is sitting right here. So it's the pipe is basically hitting the top of this, so it's clogging it. So whoever did this put it way too low, so it should be up here. But it's down here, so that's our problem. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and turn this thing on from downstairs, so let's go for it. So 
So my helper's in the attic right now. He's gonna go ahead and turn it on. Okay, I can feel air. Yeah, that's, that's what we got going on right now. Gotta love FaceTime. Yeah, it looks normal. All right, I'm gonna put the cap back on. See? Yep. Definitely the cap. All right, I pulled the cap off. It's normal. So yeah, we need to get the proper cap on here. So there's our problem. So thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe, comment, tell me what a horrible technician I am, and follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Thanks for watching.